Hi guys, this is Neil from Nismo Tech back again with a, uh, another unboxing. Um, this time, as you can see from your screen, we are looking at the Solar Blast Professional Gaming Headset uh, X2. And this is a virtual 7.1 high definition audio headset. A uh, nice picture of the unit on the front, which is a nice glossy looking unit. Let's move around the box. There's a lot of Solar Blast branding around the box until we get to the back and then here we have a little bit of blurb about the unit itself so solar blast gaming headset is designed with comfort functionality and genuine gaming pleasure in mind solar blast is connected by a single usb connector um, the headset features a bass boost button and a volume control dial on the left ear cup interesting uh, adjusting the performance and volume in seconds. Also featured is a microphone that folds into a slot on the side of the ear cup. Good, nice compact uh, feature. Uh, the ear cup itself covers your entire ear, closing off any outside interference uh, that can cause distractions. Enjoy amazing audio and hear your opponent before you see him. Dominate the game with this sophisticated gaming headset X2, all geared up. A little bit of a strap line, nice. So, we've got some specifications. Uh, channel separation is 60 decibels total harmonic distortion is 0.1 percent operating voltage is USB 5 volts and there is a, a rated current with vibration off is 50 milliamps vibration on 200 milliamps and speakers diameter is uh, 40 mil uh, sensitivity is 95 decibels uh, plus or minus 3 decibels uh, frequency response is 20 Hertz 20 kilohertz rated power is 10 megawatts uh, max power is 40 megawatts and diameter of the vibrator is uh, 30 mil um, I'm guessing this is for the vibration feature in the headset uh, frequency response is 10 Hertz to 400 Hertz uh, rated power is 100 megawatts and max power is 600 megawatts. Microphone diameter is uh, so you see that 9.7 by 4.5 mil. Uh, sensitivity is 39 plus or minus 3 decibels. Uh, directivity is is unidirectional. Uh, cable length is approximately two meters and has a USB plug. And net weight is 400 grams. So. There's your information on the unit. It's from X2 Products, their uh, website down the bottom there. So let's get into the box itself and let's have a look. So let's slide this out, put that there, and we should just pop that at the back there, like that. Will it stand up for me? No, nah, slightly. Um, okay, let's get into this box like this. Mm, interesting, interesting. So. As you can see there, there's the unit inside. Uh, we have a X2 Products installation manual for the Solar Blast, Saturn and Mars. So that's for all the headsets in one. So there's the user guide. And let's get the unit out of here. So hopefully it's not too well hidden in here. Uh, no. Okay, so that appears to be that. And just have a quick look in there. Nothing else? No, so let's put this box away for you. I'll actually just pop that back in there so that that can stand up a little bit neater for us. Okay, so here we have the headset itself, and I must say, from first look, it looks an absolutely superb quality and superbly designed headset. Um, lovely red inlays, cable itself. Let's start at the cable end. Um, there's your USB connection and a nice thick, which is nice to see. Some headsets don't have particularly thick cable, but that's a real nice quality cable. Um, going into the headset itself, let's start the ear cups where I usually like to start. Um, there is, let's try to feel here, not a great deal of movement in the actual ear cups themselves. Fairly rigid from that point of view. So 
the ear cups themselves there's not a great deal of movement but what I will say is that is obviously if you can see that there, that little button has a little V underneath it and vibration signal so that is obviously the vibration boost button uh, that's obviously your volume control there um, some X2 branding on either side and right and left and I'm going to guess there's a little V sign there I don't know I'm guessing that might light up looking at that might be wrong but we'll see when we do a little bit of a test of it and review it in a short while and uh, I'm just going to have a look here and there appears to be that is where the adjustment is ah very nice some nice steel finish underneath and that is really positive that's nice not too stiff nice clunky finish to that and uh, gives positive feedback the ear cups themselves um, nice leather finish and a lovely mesh inlay with again that red feature that red inlay uh, into the ear cups and that is a real nice feature to see these uh, these inlays um, a lot of headsets can be just plain black and not have a lot of design feature to them um, but this there's some thought really gone into this one and obviously in the ear cup there's your mic swings down there um, not a lot of flexibility in that so I hope that the mic position is uh, is good quality and that it's uh, it's not too much there's not too much distortion in that because you, obviously you're not going to be able to move that an awful lot but it's a real nice feature that it tucks away like that um, means you you know when you're not gaming or you're not talking or you're not using the headset tuck that away and then you're never going to have uh, an issue of that microphone getting caught anywhere which is a nice feature especially if you're traveling or anything like that nice compact feature tuck that away never going to get caught on anything and break off so that's uh, a real good feature on to the headband um, real solid headband uh, firm on top it's not a soft headband on top that's hard on top but a real nice thick bit of cushioning underneath um, sort of a soft feel cushioning rather than a leatherette feel which is nice uh, but that's real good padding up there um, so yeah this is the Solar Blast X2 professional gaming headset 7.1 high definition audio uh, surround sound uh, we'll be doing a review of this uh, using it for a bit of PC gaming see how we get on and uh, we'll get that review out to you as soon as possible let you know how it performs but for now that's the unboxing and uh, yeah we'll get back to you guys soon with a review and uh, if you like the video give it a like give us a sub uh, follow us on Twitter at Nismo Tech UK and we'll speak to you guys soon. We hoped you liked our video review. If you did, then please leave a like as well as any comments or questions you may have down below. Full details and specifications on this item can be found at our website, nismotech.com, along with all the links for purchasing if you wish. Also on our site, you'll find our latest reviews and current giveaways, plus a lot more. We look forward to seeing you in our next review.